What's up YouTube? Destination Kings Athletics coming at you from sunny Southern California. Got another video today. Today's video is going to be about you ain't a good player, you ain't a great player until the NBA changes its rules for you. Let's do this guys. All right guys, so like you like I said and you heard and you saw, you ain't a great player until the NBA changes rules for you. So what do you think guys? You ain't great until the NBA changes its rules. So let's go down the list. The short list or the long list, however you want to say it. Huh? Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. They changed the rules. They wanted to change the height of the, of the court. They wanted to change everything. Because they said he had an advantage because he was so tall and the sky hook was so untouchable. So they wanted to change the rules just for him. So he's great. Bing, 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 bing. He's great. Right? Michael Jordan. The Jordan rules. Bing, 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 bing. He's great. They wanted to change all the rules for him. They had special defenses. They had all kinds of stuff. If he goes here, this is what happens. If they, he goes over here, something else happens. They had the Jordan rules, guys. There's a book about the Jordan rules. Detroit Pistons, the bad boys. They had to change the rules for them because they were just too physically imposing. They were just too physical. Their play was extremely physical. People couldn't tolerate that all that hacking, all that fouling, all that aggression. They changed the rules. So the bad boys are great. Charles Barkley. Y'all know who Charles Barkley is, Sir Charles. TNT. Believe it or not, guys, undersized guy for a forward, power forward. Undersized, but he had some serious athletic ability. Serious athletic ability. Overwhelming athletic ability wall. They changed the rules for him Because he used to like to back people down after he would get the ball at three-point line and just back people down because they say hey, He had a big butt big lower body <coughs> Shh, Quiet that's my dog Shh, Quiet anyway He would back people out he would back people from the three-point line and he would back them all day He would just back them all day all day. He would back them He would back them all day and then he would just you know a little, a little chippy shot, right? A little two-foot shot. That's what he would do. So they changed the rules. Three bounces. That's all you get when you're backing people up. Three bounces. You could no longer back people up from the... You, can, you could no longer back people down from the three-point line. That's a Charles Barkley. They changed the rule for him. So bing, bing, bing. He's great. Guys, Reggie Miller. Reggie Miller from Riverside. That's right. They changed the rules for him. When he used to shoot the three-point shot, he'd come off a screen and he would flail his, he would, he would kick his legs out. He would flail his legs out. And then obviously, you're basically throwing his leg into the, into the defender. And then they would touch it. And they would call the foul. And then he would get the three-point shot and the free throw. So it was a four-point play. And he did that on a consistent basis, guys. Consistent basis. So that's my little boy right there, guys. You can't see him. There's so much light out there. Anyway. Like I said, Reggie Miller, guys. Here's my little boy. Here's my little boy right there. Look at him. Boop, boop, boop. <laughs> Say hi, Pop. Say hi, Pop. Hi. Say hi. Hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. YouTube. Subscribe to my dad's channel. It's right sus, 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 subscribe. Subscribe. It's right. Subscribe. Subscribe to my channel. That's right. Good job. Be quiet, son, because I'm doing this. Reggie Miller, guys, he would have so many four-point plays. NBA finally said, no more flailing, no more flailing your legs. Next time you flail your legs, it's an offensive foul. So they changed the rules for Reggie Miller. Bing, 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 changed the rules, so he's great. Who else did they change the rules for, guys? Yes, sir, you heard it, the king, LeBron James, they changed the whole game for him. They changed the whole game for him. What did they do? If you don't know, Come on, guys. Think about it. He's got... <laughs> he wants to shorten... He wants to shorten... Hold on. Hold on. He wants to shorten the season. I don't know. He's, he's already done it. How did he change the... How did he shorten the season? After the All-Star game, they would play the next night. You know? That following day, they would... Now they get... They get several days now. They get several days off. So he changed it because he said they played too much. He needs time off with his family. So they actually changed it. They shortened it. They shortened up the game. And... Not only did he do that, guys, he stopped showing up to games. 
He stopped showing up to games. He would sit out games. He would sit out games, so he didn't play all 82 games of the season. Now he just kind of played, I don't know, take, take 10 off. You know what I'm saying? 72 games. So that he shortened that, so he had a big impact on the NBA. Has a big impact in the game. So, guys, ding, 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 ding. He's great. He's great. Shaquille O'Neal, he would grab the ball and just throw the elbow out. You know, he would throw the elbow right into the guy's face. And power just power jam. He changed the game because they started calling that an offensive foul. When you start swinging your elbows like that, it's an offensive foul. So, bang, 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 bang. He's great. Guys, if you can think of anybody else, and I'm sure they're out there, that, that the NBA has changed the rules just to uh, uh, keep them from having a, 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 an advantage over the, uh, uh, the, the defense, let me know what you guys think, guys. If you guys can come up with anybody... Who had an offensive uh, advantage by something that they were doing? Let me know. Comment, like, subscribe, guys. Let me know how you guys think. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you even agree with this. And don't forget, the biggest one, the biggest influence, the biggest game changer in the game to date. Yeah. That's right, Allen Iverson. Allen Iverson changed the whole entire game. Yeah. Corn rolls. Corn rolls. Can't wear cornrows. You gotta dress appropriately to the games. He used to come in. He used to come in looking like a gangster. He used to come in with chains, gold everywhere. Can't do that anymore. You gotta look presentable now. He changed it. Allen Iverson, the greatest. Well, I don't want to say of all time, but he is a great. Ding, ding, ding. He is a great. He changed the game. He changed the game. You can no longer walk into the game game night. Away or home, it don't matter. You can't walk into a game looking like a thug. You can't wear gold chains, earrings, all that stuff. You can't wear none of that stuff on the fingertips. None of that. AI changed the game. AI, you changed the game. One of the greatest ever. Guys, like, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Destination Kings, guys. Athletics, don't forget that. Bye-bye.